Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Ubuntu Server 24.04.2 LTS version on VMware Workstation. First, go to Ubuntu official website and download ubuntu.com. Then click on download Ubuntu. Then see here we have the desktop and server. So click on server, then click on get server. See here the latest server region is 24.04.2. Click on download for direct ISO. If you want to download by using torrent link, you have to click on alternative downloads. So I want to download direct ISO file. So click on download and its size is 3, 3 gigabytes. Click on download 24.04. Wait a moment, download will be started. See, download started. See here, its size is 3 gigabytes. I am cancelling this one because I have already downloaded Ubuntu Server 24.04.2 server edition. In your case, wait until download completes. Once the download is completed, then open VMA Workstation Pro or VMA Workstation Player. But the installation process is same on both. Click on Create a New Virtual Machine or go to File and select New Virtual Machine. Then select the Installer Disk Image File that is ISO. Click on Browse. Then select the Downloaded Ubuntu Server. ISO file. Select it and click on open. Then click on next. Then here we have to provide the name for the virtual machine. I am giving UB24042 VM. Then select the folder to store this virtual machine files and folders by clicking on this browse. Select the path where you have the NO space. I am giving UBS because this is a server edition. So click on next. Now we have to provide the virtual hard disk size. I am giving 100 gigabytes. Then click on next. See this is the summary of the virtual machine. If you want to edit any one of them, you have to click on customize hardware. Otherwise keep as it is and don't select this power on this virtual machine after creation. Then click on finish. Still, if you want to edit settings of this virtual machine, click on edit virtual machine settings or right click and select settings or VM and select settings. All three options are same. If you are working with all the settings, then click on power on this virtual machine. Use up and down arrows and select the first one that is try or install Ubuntu server and hit enter. See if cursor is grayed out, just press Ctrl Alt or Alt Ctrl from your keyboard to release the cursor. Use up and down arrows and select the language and hit enter. Select keyboard language and select done by using up and down arrows or use tab button to come to this done button and hit enter. See here, choose the type of installation, Ubuntu Server or Ubuntu Server Minimized. Use the tabs to come to this, if you want to, Ubuntu Server, if you want to use this one. But if you, I don't want, so go up and use the spacebar to select it. Additional options, search for third party drivers, I don't want at this moment. It is up to you, select run and hit enter. This is the IP, continue without network. I don't want to configure any proxy, so select done and hit enter. Done. Continue. Guided storage configuration. Use entire disk because, because this is fresh installation. So select done and hit enter. See this is the storage configuration information. If you want, if you are okay with this one, select done. Or if you want to reset the configurations, you have to select this reset. I am okay with these settings now. So select done and hit enter. This is confirmation. Click on continue. Now we have to set up or create user. So I am giving user full name as R2 schools. Then we have to provide the server. Then here we have to provide the username. Then set the password for this user. Confirm the same. Hit enter. Select done and hit enter. If you want to enable Ubuntu Pro, you have to select the first one. I don't want so. Select skip for now and continue. If you want to install open SS server, select checkbox. Otherwise, unselect it. I want to install, so select done and hit enter. See, if you want to add this feature server snap, you have to select by using 
up, down arrow and give the space bar to select. I don't want any one of them. So select done and hit end. See, installation has been started. This may take time. And then it will ask us to reboot the system. Then we will reboot and we will perform the post installation steps for the Ubuntu server 24.04.2 on VMware workstation. In the meantime, please subscribe my channel for more tutorials. See, installation completed. Use the tab to come to reboot now and hit enter. See message, please remove the installation medium and then press enter. Okay, so right click on this virtual machine, go to settings, then select CD DVD, then and select this connected and connected power on and click on OK, then hit enter. Hit enter, then provide the username that you have created. Provide the password of this user. Also see here, we have installed Ubuntu Server 24.04.2. Okay, and this is the system resources information. Okay, control L to clear screen and verify the version that we have installed more slash etc os hyphen release to check the version of the Ubuntu server that we have installed. See, we have installed Ubuntu server 24.04.2 and its code name is Noble. If you want to verify the IP of this machine, just give if config. See, command not found, we can install this if config by using this sudo apt install net tools or we can get the IP address by running the command ip addr. See, this is the IP of the machine. Install that net tools sudo apt install net hyphen tools. Provide the password of the sudo user. All done. Again, control it. Now run the same if config. See, you got the IP of the machine. The first step after installing Ubuntu server is we have to update and upgrade the packages. sudo apt update ampersand ampersand sudo apt upgrade hit enter type 5 for confirmation and hit enter see everything done control it so in this video we have seen how to download and install ubuntu server 24.04.2 ltz version on vmware workstation for more tutorials please subscribe my channel thank you